lap, left back to line. Number two following Kenzie and Heavier, but three and mile five. Okay, number two. Hey everyone, Jared here from Real Sim Gear with a quick overview of our GFC 500 Autopilot for x and P3D. So here you'll find the uh, unit itself. Uh, on the side you'll find a single USB port uh, with the provided USB cable. We'll uh, connect this to your PC and uh, all the signals from the, from the buttons and knobs will be sent back to the flight simulator. Also on the back you'll see four small mounting holes which allow you to mount this unit to uh, any of our desktop brackets or combinations of those and the GCU bracket or if you wish uh, your own panel. Uh, we provide PDF files, DXF files, all that sort of stuff on our website for the cutout instructions. So on the front, you'll see we've got two knobs here, which is, this is the exact replica of the real Garmin GFC 500. So you've got a heading track adjust with a push button for sync and altitude adjust and sync uh, and button on the, on the you know, right hand side. Also you've got the thumb wheel here, which is used for adjusting your autopilot settings, say your indicated airspeed, uh, climbs and that sort of stuff, uh, vertical speed or your set altitude. All the buttons here are uh, uh, really durable rubber buttons and uh, on top of those is an LED indicator which shows which mode the autopilot is set into and they will come on and off as you change modes. Uh, so there you have it, this is the GFC 500. It's included with our GCU stack, um, which is a part of our Sirius Perspective package or it's available uh, on its own. It's also included in our GTN 750 and, and GFC 500 bundle. So there you have it. Any questions at all, please feel free to hit us up. Info at realsimgear.com. Thanks.